Hi, I'm Peter Kalmström of Kalmström.com Business Solutions. In this demonstration, I will show you how to use the highlighted content web part. That's perhaps the most uh, useful and powerful of the web parts available in the new page model, in my opinion. And as we see, that by default, it does a search to find the most recent documents, and it gives you a very nice preview of those two. So that's nice, but you have a lot more options here. So you can select the source, where should the content be from, this site collection or all sites or this site. And you can select which type of information you want. And also you can uh, select more, several different content types. So you have an option of having several of those. Now you see it change it automatically here. But I want documents. And those are nicest for now. And you can select just one type of document if, if you want that. That's the, the content you want. And then down here you can filter. So there you can select on the title, you can select on the content. That is the full body search of your content. Recently added, recently changed, created by, and so on. The most powerful one is probably the managed property. So if you have tagged your information with enterprise keyword, for example, then you can go in and click uh, the managed property and then find a specific managed property. And as you might know, there are a lot of managed properties, about 700 of them by default. So these are the most common ones. Um, but if you go in and search for one, for example, the OWS, those are the most commonly used ones. Here you'll find that the OWS tags, metadata, all tags info, that's the one where enterprise keywords is stored. So you might want to use that one. That's really powerful. And then you can have the sorting by most recent or most viewed trending or by a specific managed property is, of course, uh, powerful too. Finally, you can have the layout, the cards, or the list. As you see, the cards are very nice with the um, preview up there. And also you can see how many items should be displayed at a time. So this is a powerful web part uh, that you can use in the new page model. If you're using the old model, then you would use content by search, but this is the equivalent. Thank you for watching this demo.